ladies and gentlemen, thank you for being here. If I may now have your attention, please take your jackets and follow me outside. The presentation is about to start. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for being here. If I may now have your attention, please take your jackets and follow me outside. The presentation is about to start.
Hello everyone and thank you for being here despite this wonderful weather. It's a very special day for us. My name is Svilen. And I'm Konstantin. And we're the co-founders of Dronamics, a company we started more than seven years ago with a mission to enable same-day shipping for everyone everywhere. We're really excited to show you our uh, aircraft, the Black Swan. And thank you for making it all the way here. So please enjoy. Thank you. Let up. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It's a very special day today. Um, today is the International CV Aviation Day. Uh, in, uh, it's the anniversary of the signing of the Chicago Convention with which modern aviation uh, exists. But it's also a day where we unveil the first aircraft that was designed specifically for cargo. If you think about it, for more than 100 years, people designed airplanes to have humans on board. Um, and this was a tremendous achievement for humanity, but also uh, quite a bit of a constraint and we're here to tell you how this aircraft is going to change commerce yes so in front of you you can see the aircraft uh, and we decided to develop a whole ecosystem of a solution uh, the point is that actually current freight is either too expensive when you're talking about air transport or just too slow when you're envisioning maritime or just unreliable to, due to the weather um, when you talk about uh, ground transport. It's, um, so, so the airplane itself is just one piece in three core technologies that we're developing. And those are uh, a minimum low-cost drone port, a minimum low-cost and standardized drone, and also the automated flight control system to guide it all. You see here the airplane, the drone. You see here the control, Ground control station. And yeah, we're going to build a fleet of those drones to serve the whole world. This aircraft is capable of transporting goods of 350 kilograms across two and a half thousand kilometers. I'll let that just sink in. It's, it's quite the achievement. And keep in mind that in order for this to be functioning properly, we need the other two parts of the solution. We need the ground control station to monitor the hundreds, and hopefully in the next couple of years, the thousands, if not hundreds of thousands, of airplanes that will be airborne at any given time all over the world. And of course, if we have that many airplanes, there's not enough airfields to land. So this is why we made them so robust and standardized so they don't have to land and take off from runways like this one. They can land anywhere pretty much in the world. And in fact, uh, here tonight with us, we have representatives from some of the 40 airports from 12 countries that uh, are part of our drone port network and we're very excited to start serving those locations as early as next year. Um, we'll be starting flights first in Europe and then Australia and other countries and regions. But on, a, on an operational concept, it's, it's an airplane, right? So it, it still needs ground handlers, it still needs mechanics, and it still needs pilots. Only in our case, the pilots will be 
at the airport. Um, and they, together with the ground handlers and mechanics, will m make sure the aircraft is turned around in the shortest possible time. But it's a super efficient model that contributes to this aircraft being able to achieve rates at uh, as little as one euro per kilo. Uh, and that's quite something, because you can finally connect places point to point at a very low cost very quickly. Now, applications can range from e-commerce, pharma, uh, spare parts, uh, perishables, and of course time critical goods. But sustainability is also top of mind for us. In, uh, in terms of belly freight and, and freighters, we're actually lower emissions. Uh, and we're lower emissions even than cargo vans. And again, this thing can take as much cargo as a cargo van. So we're, uh, it's actually a lot more fuel efficient. But we are also working to certify it for flights on 100% biofuels by 2023. So that's quite exciting. And we wouldn't be here if it wasn't for... Thank you. We wouldn't be here if it wasn't for... A bunch of great people who are right now watching, which is the great team. So thank you. Thank you for helping us. Thank you. Really. So that's it, guys. This is the Black Swan. Enjoy it. Enjoy the evening. Thank you for being here. Thank you for everyone, to everyone who is watching. And um, we'll see you soon. We'll see you soon. Thank, thank you. you. Ha 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 